hello guys welcome back to our channel so as you can see i am all by myself today and that's because mercedes actually has no idea i'm making this vlog so the reason for that is because it is her birthday this weekend wednesday today i have us booked a hotel for friday to sunday the plan is to decorate it i got like a bunch of decorations from party city earlier so I'm gonna set it up all cute and then bring her there, surprise her. And then the first night will kind of be like just us. Saturday, I have a really fun day planned for us. I'm actually meeting up with one of her friends and I think we're gonna go to the zoo. And then after that, we wanna go to a brewery and then out for dinner. And then we're gonna go back to the hotel for like some free drinks and then out at night, probably to like a bar, like a patio bar or something like that. So let me show you guys what I got to decorate the room. Okay, so I got a bunch of stuff from Party City and I don't know if you could tell, the theme is like black and gold. So I got these black cups and then I got this happy birthday thing to blow up. I'm gonna get these filled with helium, some confetti balloons. This is for, um, I'm gonna create like a little bar area and I'm gonna hang this over like the little bar that I set up. And then we got, oh, candles. Um, Mercedes never tells anyone her age. So we just say she's turning 45. So her birthday candles. Got some cute little black and gold plates. What else I got? Some napkins here. And then we got confetti. And then we got these two huge numbers, which I think I'm gonna set these up on the table where like the whole bar setup is gonna be. Before I go to the hotel, I'm gonna go and pick up two huge like 45 balloons and I'm gonna get, I think I'm gonna get some like black helium balloons too. And then I also wanna go get her stuff to make like a charcuterie board in the room because Mercedes is obsessed with jacuterie. Like she has a sick obsession. So I think I'm just gonna make her like a bomb ass board. I also got her this really nice bottle of sparkling something like champagne or Prosecco or I don't know what's in here. But I figured it was just really nice and it would go with the black and gold theme. In terms of her gift, I actually already gave it to her because she had to go and pick them out. She's always wanted a pair of Timberland boots. So I actually ordered her a pair online but they came so freaking massive. Like it could literally fit two of her feet. Went to the mall together and she actually picked out the pair that she wanted the most. So she already has the boots, but she obviously has no idea about like the hotel and like all the stuff we're doing this weekend. Still wanted to get her like something to open on her birthday. So I just got her, it's nothing big. I know she really liked the like teakwood cologne from Bath and Body Works, but they didn't have any. So I ended up grabbing her the teakwood body spray, a little teakwood hand sanitizer, and I'm gonna go shopping for a few other things tomorrow. Whenever her and I get hotels for each other, we always make sure that they have like a whirlpool or like a spa tub because we love taking baths together. So I'm probably gonna go to Walmart and get like some bath bombs and like bubble bath and stuff like that to do a nice bath. I think I have some rose petals here that I'll probably bring. And yeah, I just wanna make it all like cute and romantic, but then also like gold glitter party vibes too. These are gonna be for Mercedes's birthday. It's in two days, but we're going shopping and they would really match with her current outfit. So I'm letting her wear them. Love you, thank you, baby. They look so good on you. Oh my God. My girlfriend is so fucking hot. You wanna fuck me? Absolutely, let's go. Okay. Are you okay? Belly, I'm not crying, I was just kidding. He does this every time he thinks I'm crying. Hi. Oh, sweet guy. Wow. Model, baby. Oh, yes. Yeah, it looks really good. It's been a few days, it's now Friday, and 
and it's the day that I'm checking into the hotel. So it's about almost two o'clock now and I've just left Mercedes house and I told her that I was going to get my nails done in another city. And so she's like not expecting me. She's like out like going shopping with her mom, I think. So I have a few hours to go get the rest of the stuff I need to get, go set up the hotel and then come back, pick her up and then I'll bring her there. But first things first is I have to get gas because I'm running on nearly empty and the gas station I have to go to is like 20 minutes away. So I'm gonna see if I can make it there without breaking down. So I don't think I filmed it yesterday, but I actually went and I picked her up a watch. I'm really freaking excited. I'm four minutes away from the gas station. Will I make it? It's about 2.30 now. So I'm gonna try and get this all done in an hour and a half. We'll see if I can do it. So I'm done at Walmart. I literally don't even know what time it is. It's probably close to three o'clock. But now I have to go to the dollar store to get like shot glasses and like cutlery and like tissue paper and like random shit like that. Then I have to go get the balloons blown up, then go to the hotel. And I didn't realize, but I probably should have left to do this a little bit earlier, but like, it's fine. So it's almost four o'clock and I'm still waiting on the balloons, um, but I'll be going to check into the hotel immediately after this. So hopefully it doesn't take too long. Okay. Try not to stress right now, but Mercedes is texting me because I've been like two freaking hours. So I just have to keep lying to her about where I am. I got the balloons, but I'm really upset because I was supposed to get like the number balloons, like the 45, but they didn't have any matching ones. And I went to two different stores. I try not to stress. Cause I mean, there's no like crazy rush, but I just didn't want her to get suspicious of me. Like I was trying to get it done really fast so she wouldn't be suspicious but like she definitely knows i'm up to something this room low-key high-key fucking sucks sadies and i have stayed here plenty of times and i've always like selected the same thing when i book it online like with the whirlpool tub which is like a huge it's like a jacuzzi tub and this tub is literally so fucking small with a baby jet like not even one fucking person can fit in there and like the whole point of us booking this room and paying extra for this room is so that we can both fit in the thing. I her downstairs, I was like, okay, like, is there anything else that I could get, blah, blah, blah. And it was pretty much gonna be $500 more to get a different room. Okay, so this is what I have set up so far. I kind of just put the balloons there and then I'm just gonna take some of this little like confetti and sprinkle it. That looks cute, right? Okay guys, we're making it work. I think she'll like it. Okay, so I'm gonna try and figure out how to blow up this little happy birthday thing. Happy! All right guys, I'm fucking killing it. Okay, so I got those to stick up, but like the walls here are material, so tape doesn't really stick to this, so I'm assuming by the time I bring her back, um, this will all be on the fucking floor. I just had a vision for what I thought this room was gonna look like, and I definitely felt disappointed when I saw what I was dealing with, but at the end of the day, we're gonna have an amazing weekend. Doesn't matter. Um, I know it's just like the thought that counts, so let's go get Mercedes. Hey, baby, look where we are. Wow. Did you have any idea we were coming here? Not a clue. <laughs> Tequila. You're lying. Oh, oh my god. I was like, no fucking way. <laughs> it's so dark. Is it only light? No. Are you serious? Happy birthday. Aww. Holy shit, babe. Holy shit. <laughs> it's so dark. Wait. Aww, look at the fireball. It's a party. Wait. 
Oh yeah. All right. Take this one. How do you feel about your little birthday surprise? Um, surprised. You're not surprised. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> you want to show them your so watch? Sweet. I really love it. Looks so good on you. I was worried you were going to want um, like the black one or a silver one. Like this. Look at it. Mm. Yeah, that's good. <sighs> um, so, yeah, my baby is happy. Yeah. You look so excited. You seem so excited for your birthday. That's why I didn't want you to film me opening the gifts. Because people are going to think that I hate everything. Because I'm like, oh my god, yay, thank you. But that, <laughs> that's you being excited. That's I'm so excited and so happy. But Yeah, that's her genuine reaction. Yeah, that's why I said don't film. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> put that out. Never, that's staying in. So I think we are going to... <gasps> oh yeah i think we are going to start taking some shots i guess i'll throw you on this bed <laughs> <laughs> um oh baby oh my god this is for you too not only fans so we're gonna take some fireball shots and we are gonna get ready and then we're gonna go out for some drinks right baby yeah birthday celebrations begin yeah. T minus, what time is it right now? It's my birthday, three hours. T minus two hours and 45 minutes till Mercedes turns, Mercedes, till Mercedes mm -hmm. turns 45 years old. Yeah. Mm. Uh. Oh yeah, fuck me. I love you. Thank you so much. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Let's fucking party. I thought you were gonna say let's fucking Oh, let's do that too. Bye. Mm. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday, baby. Mm -mm. Good morning guys it is officially my baby's birthday mm. she's very sleepy girl mm. um so we stayed up pretty late last night till like 4 30 and it's 10 o'clock now so we're a little bit tired but i've just ordered us some breakfast slowly start getting ready the vlog already knows the plans but um you don't get to know our plans but we're gonna leave here around like 12 30 because we have to be somewhere for one o'clock so mm. 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 i'm so excited to spend the day celebrating you and having fun this was sweet mm -hmm. some breakfast some fresh orange juice let's see your makeup baby i'm probably gonna do my makeup and i'm gonna start trying to make it oh hot mm. the cut that out my whole vagina was in it no it wasn't no it was no it wasn't mm -hmm. babe i was looking i saw it you're so beautiful you. I love you. Cute. They're like babies. Yeah. Oh, look at this mm -hmm. one coming. <laughs> oh, there's a third. I didn't even yeah. notice. Can I just try the one there? Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Whoa. 
Holy. <gasps> Holy shit. Oh my god, look! <laughs> Why is he going like that? <laughs> this is literally for OnlyFans. Is there a dingleberry in there? <laughs> oh. oh. Hi. Hi. Hey guy, what's up? How you doing? You good? Have fun. That was the cutest so cute. thing ever. Oh Why my you god. Did that? I wish you could be free. Hi. Little doe. That shows you like how you human deer are because deers are the beast most skittish. Yeah. Yeah. So skittish. <laughs> this is what you think you're ordering on Sheen versus what shows up in real life. <laughs> Tail. This looks like Bentley. The ears. <laughs> Giraffes are the cutest. No, come back. Please come back. For some reason, I thought otters are playing. Hi! Oh my god, are you kidding me? Hi! Babe, you made her leave! I just asked. Well, what the fuck? I made her leave, yeah. You did! It was me, for sure. She can understand English. She can! You called her ugly! So Mercedes took this photo of Bentley. <laughs> Uncanny resemblance. Hi guys. We finished at the zoo and then we went to like just back to the hotel to like freshen up quickly. And now we're on to surprise number two for the day. Uh-huh. Good day, yeah, the zoo was so fun. All the monkeys. I want one. You want a monkey? That's your favorite animal. I think so. My favorite animal used to be a cheetah, but those monkeys were so cute. What were they called? Squirrel. Squirrel like, monkeys. Yeah, squirrel monkeys. They were literally oh, their they heads. Were she was like, their heads look so soft. <laughs> oh, I was obsessed. I've so not been to the zoo in a really long time, and I, I wanted to do it, so I'm very happy that we did it, and I had a lot of fun. Yeah. And um, Mercedes's best friend Melissa, like met us oh, there, and yeah, she had no idea that she was coming. Me. Yeah, you were really. Surprised. I was shook. Mm -hmm. I was literally shook because she came up from behind me and like grabbed me. and was like, "Happy birthday, sweet girl!" And I was like, Ugh. "I literally had a heart attack." I was like, "What <laughs> are you doing?" Because she told me that she was working today, so yeah. I'm sleepy now. I know, but we're gonna go wake her up. We're gonna go get some drinks and food for our next little surprise place. A really good night. Yeah. I think once we eat, we'll have like a lot more energy. Mm -hmm. Like yeah, I, I feel just tired, really but I'm like just body. really amped for like you to have such a good day. And then I'm like, all right, let's go. Yeah. Let's go. I'm gonna get wasted. Yep. hundred percent you will. I'm gonna be taking care of you tonight, baby. Um, do you mean taking advantage? Yes, that's 
what oh, I okay. meant to say. Got it. Precisely that, yes. Thank you for correcting me. Mm-hmm. Gotcha. <laughs> I love you, baby. You're so sweet. Thank you for everything so far. Of course, I love you. She spoiled me. We'll see you at the next surprise. This is about your birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday, baby. I have no Wi Fi. Oh no, what are we gonna do? How are you gonna live on your birthday with no Wi Fi? <laughs> Right now. My bestie. Aww. You. Happy birthday, dear Mercedes. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. It has been multiple days <sighs> since the last clip we filmed. Shocker. That's not like us at all. Back to the room. Um, you actually decided to take a nap. And I oh, had yeah. a bunch of her friends coming over to surprise her that you had no idea were coming. I had no idea. Um, so everything was like really rushed. I had to get ready quickly and then wake her up. And literally as I was waking you up, your friends started showing up one by one. How did you feel? I was so was shocked. Up? I was literally so shocked. I had no idea that any of that was gonna happen. So um, I had no idea, it was insane. And then we went to like a rooftop bar, club, whatever. Um, and I got blackout drunk. Blackout. I've never seen her this fucked up in her I don't whole think life. I've ever been that fucked up in my whole life. Like, falling over type of blackout. Remember, nothing, like, just bits and pieces of everything for the rest of the night. Like, literally mm -hmm. bits and pieces. When she's telling me things, I'm like, you're lying. Like, absolutely not. Um... So embarrassing, and it wasn't embarrassing. She had such a good night. I puked a lot, <laughs> a lot, which again I don't remember. I remember puking one time, and then dry heaving one time. And Carly told me I puked like forty times. It was so much, and I had to literally. She was laying off the bed. I was like holding a bucket for her. You were barfing in it, and then passing out, and then in between her like passing out because I knew you'd wake up again to throw up. So I'd literally be trying to like clean up the garbage, like switch the bags because it was literally, there was so much puke in one bag. It was like, this is way TMI, but this is literally what happened. I like had to like take off all her jewelry. I had like a cloth on her neck, her head. Also, like, can we please talk about the Invisalign thing? Cause I think that is so yeah, fucking yeah, hilarious. So I have Invisalign and I'm only supposed to, like I'm supposed to wear my trays like 22 hours a day. And so my main focus is always my Invisalign. And I guess, I don't remember this at all. Carly just told me, as soon as I got back to the hotel, I started like brushing and flossing my teeth. I couldn't even stand. She was literally falling I literally over couldn't stand. everywhere. And she runs straight to the bathroom and starts flossing her I don't even, where were my Invisalign? Like, I don't even know where they were. Like, um, I think you left them at the hotel. I think they were in the bathroom already. So I pop in my Invisalign and Carly's like, um, you probably shouldn't do that. Like you're going to puke. And I was like, I'm not going to puke. Why it's would like, I puke? Yes, you are. <laughs> I don't have any recollection of this, but, um, and then I guess I like laid in the bed and immediately popped out my Invisalign trays and then started yeah. puking. But the fact that you even knew to take out your Invisalign before I know, throwing up But is I couldn't walk. I didn't know how, I couldn't remember how to walk. You couldn't see. You also couldn't see. You I lost could your not, vision. I could not see a thing. And then I remember I puked the first time and I was like, oh my, was it the first time? Yeah, I think And then so. I was like, oh my God, I can see again. Cause I had no vision. Everything was black. I could hear, but it was black. So fucked up. Well, next day we like checked out of the hotel came home and just like laid in bed and had like a hangover day even the day after that you oh, were feeling better but your stomach mess. was still like messed up mm -hmm. um so yeah so now we're fully um recuperated um and realized that we did not even close out this vlog also realized that i am way too old to be hungover yeah i used to not even i would get like a little headache and now i'm like bedridden for 48 hours yeah <laughs> <laughs> so awful i know i literally used to go out and i would literally get so fucked up and barely sleep and then the next i'd go to work for the full day and then do it again the next night yep now being at work hungover was a piece of cake i can't oh even be God, in my own bed hungover like, right you had a really good birthday yeah and, i had a great birthday um i also had me. 
I also had a really great time. It was it was amazing. You had a good time I, taking care of me. Well, yeah. Obviously, I didn't want you to be sick, but it's something that we've never experienced together mm -hmm. before. So it was like a new experience for me too, like yeah. being able to take care of you. And I love taking care of you. You know I do. Like I'm so like mm -hmm. motherly and nurturing that mm -hmm. that's like mommy issues yeah <laughs> yeah i yeah i love taking care of you and um i would do it again and again and again and you're gonna have to um, okay get this nice watch that carly got for me i'm so glad you like i that. love it because you didn't think i was gonna like it because yeah of the color. i didn't think you were gonna love the color but i love the. i was gonna get you the all black one because i feel like that was more you but when i saw this i was no, like this, this is, is way, way too nice yeah this is so nice Mm -hmm. Um, so I'm wearing this every day, but yeah, I love it. Oh, his nails. I know. Ow! Speaking of surprises and gifts, XOX Toys sent us an immaculate vibrator. <laughs> so XOX Toys sent us a surprise box, so we did not know what we'd be receiving, and inside was the Satisfier Power Flower which i've never heard of this toy before i've heard of like the satisfier brand but not this toy specifically and oh my god i wish i knew about this sooner so good it is literally so good it has how many different settings like 12 it has 12 settings yeah 12 vibration modes yeah it's super quiet yeah soft super silicone. powerful guys the power in this <laughs> little thing yeah oh it has body safe silicone it's waterproof I used um this end part here but mercedes used the side of it yeah this because the whole thing vibrates so you yeah. can kind of choose like, what you this want this also moves around as well yeah but i liked just using the side of it that was yeah. like the best for me we are super grateful that xox toys has gifted us this but they are also gifting you guys 50 percent off this specific toy on an already affordable vibrator yeah it's like 60 something dollars already yeah. so they're giving you 50 percent off on top of it already being super freaking cheap so i would not hesitate on this so our coupon code is carly xox mercedes we'll leave it right here like here always somewhere. um yes. so yeah check that out and thank you so much to xox toys for gifting us this new toy we mm -hmm. are literally obsessed and look at the cute little handle you can use this to like- I'll put it on my keychain. I know. <laughs> Pretty much wraps up today's vlog. Um, we really hope you guys enjoyed coming along for Mercedes's birthday surprise. I know we never film like the best parts. Like I'm sure you guys really want to see Mercedes drunk and all that stuff. But next I just time. was not thinking of filming in those moments. But next time we'll do better. Trying to work on getting better. We really um, hope you guys enjoy it. And if you did, don't forget- to like this video comment subscribe to our channel also if you're not following us already follow us on our social medias we have instagram tiktok and OnlyFans, which we have just started uploading all of our photo shoot photos you guys definitely don't want to miss out on those photos yeah too good too good to miss too freaking good to miss anyways thank you guys so much for watching we love you and we will see you in the next video Bye. Bye.